on the front really just stepped up. Bunch of good guys hopped on tour this year, so it's gonna be a tough competition. I'm sure we're gonna have to race Overton and Owens a good bit, so there's plenty more guys that could, could go win and be competitive on national tour races, and they make it easy with the money that they paid. You know, the national tour doesn't look as good as uh, a deal like this. I think, honestly, it'd be just as hard to run Lucas as it is to hunt the front series. The competition is gonna be, I mean, it's gonna be top notch this year. All tech, I've come from dead last to run up up front, win races there. We run fifth in the Lucas Oil race this year. You know, it's a place that's really, really technical and difficult to get around, and it starts to die off really, really fast. And the racetrack will change two and a half to three seconds throughout the night. It has a good groove to it. You can run pretty much anywhere on the track, and it's super racy. We done got this one washed up, ready oh, to be yeah. worked on. Oh yeah. Y'all got this one back together from oh, where man. Jesse ran over that boy? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, that was really the main, uh, yeah, a little bit of that, but that, the main work was in the front end, trying to re replacing the rack and everything. We had another rack to put on it? We went to Bo's house and got one. Oh, okay. Uh, so, she had something there. So you think we fixed whatever steering issues you've been complaining about? Well, we'll find out. We're troubleshooting you, that's for sure. <laughs> what? Go. Yeah. It's gonna be late. We're late. Act like y'all got home at four o'clock or something. I don't give a goddamn about none of that. It's time to go now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. First of all, I think it was more like three o'clock. Yeah. And secondly, you don't need hot laps. You'll be that's fine. Door oh, we don't need hot. So we are getting ready to go to Southern Raceway. We we're coming off a big night of racing last night at Buckshot where we ran both cars. Joseph finished sixth with the Spring Nationals in the super late model out there. And Jesse got him a win in Faithful here. Dr. Jordy said some uh, things that can't be said. No. So going back to our last trip to Southern, Right with this car was when you got in the wreck, they piled up in front of you. Yeah, how hurt. was that though? 10,000 win. Back in February, hurt the rack. Put her spare rack on there. Jesse's been complaining about it. Last night was the second time we'd run it. And he had yeah, a little bit of something, going something on. not quite right with it. So we borrowed one from Bo, and hopefully that'll fix that problem. We'll be good to go for tonight. And kind of did some body work back here. Just had a little bit of damage right yeah. there on the deck. I think we had to replace the spoiler side. Yeah, like. Same same quarter panel. Big shout out to uh, Five Star Plastic Body. Hey, <laughs> they'll take. You a can door a guy, I and it doesn't even look like you did it. Hey, you, they'll take a beat. <laughs> take my word for take it. Take a licking and keep on ticking. Just just look who's driving the damn thing. Jordan. <laughs> they thought we were going back in the big trailer for a second. Yeah. Yeah. Why ain't you got the four wheeler? Oh, it's already loaded. Oh, yeah, we can't. Just push it up in there. Yeah, right. Hey, check out that steering buddy in action. Is that our new one? That's our old one. Oh. Still works as good. Jesse doesn't get the new one. No. I guess I'll go get my helmet and everything else. Yeah, you might need that. Alright. Yeah, So while we're on the subject, I want to put in a little plug for a big racing weekend coming up at Alltech. That's where we'll be racing. Joseph will be racing the Super Late Model next. This weekend, upcoming, Alltech Raceway, Hunt the Front Super Dirt Series, round two and three. Come on down to Alltech or catch it all live on huntthefront.tv. the southern raceway right out down the road from the race shop we were just out here last week for the southern all-stars super late model double header and and we were here quite a bit um, with modifieds earlier in the year with the flash on the coast but this is only the second time this year we've been out here running the crate cars jesse made his debut in faithful out here with the crate racing usa series back in february had a good run going 
until a uh, few of them piled up in front of him and tore up a lot of stuff but he was fast here jesse's always pretty good at southern gonna be a good field it's their season opener regular season opener and i think we'll have a good field of crates racing uh racing for the first points race of the year what exactly He went to Tech. I went to Tech. Well, yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. I, Fine colors. This <laughs> cheap. He literally can't help himself. Fantastic. Yeah, okay. Let, let me go screw that up for you. It's Fine. still straight. Look right. It's still. Look down at it. It's still legal. Right. So Jesse will be on the track three times tonight. We are about to roll for hot laps, and then a little bit later on he will qualify, and then at the end of the night, they will run 20 laps, 1,000 to win, main event. turn one you move down that last lap you know and, and that was better right. um and then turn three you were charged the first like two laps or whatever you were charging in there too hard you kind of huh i got a bad habit of that of overdriving yeah <laughs> yeah you were up too high then you kind of moved down slowed down a little bit in three and four and you were better your last lap was the better one these Maybe are it's gonna be nothing but more rubber when we go what'd you draw we're like right in the middle going out, I think. Yeah. Like fifth or sixth out of 12. Uh, I was over towards, you know? Hey, how's the steering? If I'm slipping. Oh, yeah. my problem is all. Really? Really? So that rack's got an issue. Yes. Does Bo even know we borrowed his rack? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that, yes, that fixes it. Jesse is the fifth car out. You're the fifth car out to qualify out of 12 of them. And the way they qualify right here decides how they start the main event later. Ain't got my 
fancy tire grinder this weekend. Uh, no, do it old fashioned. Yeah, you can make do. Jesse up there. Hey, that's all right. Yeah. It'll be okay. I think if we could have got it turned around four, yeah. I'd been we Well, like we said good. before you, you went out to qualify, it doesn't matter where you start, you can win it from anywhere on these tracks you like that. <laughs> I'm just trying to cheer you up. <laughs> you, hey, we're, you're gonna win it and make it in a hey. This yeah. video, if everything would have went like it's supposed to, would have been boring. Yeah. You'd have gone out there, set fat, did you'd have done what you did last night. Here's what we want. On camera, document it right now. Check a flag or a steering wheel. <laughs> hey, yeah, he's That's giving you full permission. We ain't coming out. We ain't doing that. A trophy or a jig? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's it. I mean, I'd be. I mean, yeah. just pass a few cars. <laughs> try to get them all if you can. But you know, oh. they're exaggerating a little. Starting eighth, and uh, it's one of them deals where you gotta watch them, but you gotta go. Like you need not to wreck on the first lap, but you also need to be in about fifth by the end of lap two. So whatever you gotta do to make that happen, all right? All right. All right. <laughs> gotta watch them though. So if y'all watched enough of our videos by now, I'm sure you are, you are aware that passing is going to be uh, really hard right here. The problem that creates is Jesse's got to get every every start, every restart, Jesse has got to pick up positions. But starts and restarts are also going to be when you have guys fighting over the rubber, fighting over the one groove, and when you're going to have 
things happening that lead to big wrecks. Well, like I told Jesse, the simple thing is you keep an eye on them, they go to wrecking, you do a port mission and get out of the way and let them wreck and miss it. But at the same time, they slip up, you got to be there and be ready to pass them and improve a position.
I love it. I just couldn't get down the straightaway. I felt away. fine, could not right. leave from there. I agree. That's what it looked like. Yeah. yeah. Usually that's a, that's a here problem. Yeah, it could have been. But I also yeah. think that helped me. Right, I know. I just, gotta be on and qualifying. That's what we learned tonight. We needed to be or, about where we, we were knew right that. here qualifying. Right. Yeah, well, hey, you didn't you didn't tear up the car. Everything's an onion. Yeah. You use it up? Yeah, that's my right. big so time. So buckshot, you know. Yeah. Buckshot, it's like, you know, I'm like, oh, I need a safety tire. So I rode a lot of the race. I wasn't going fast right. if I could. Right. You're in the lead, So too, I'm like, so. and we still had some meat left after 20. Uh -huh. So this time, tonight, Joe's like, look, his tire, it'll make it 20 laps. There ain't no racetrack in America, a 21. Can't, can't make, make it 20, 20 laps, laps without going flat. It's going to go the same speed till it goes flat. Mm -hmm. Your fastest lap was lap 18. <laughs> you I didn't also, have much. I you also did. ran harder. There. I'm just saying, like you know, <laughs> that holds true. You might not have made it another five, but no. for those of you, you'd have been fast idiot. until it went. Your two had more meat on it than that after 40. I'm a, I'm a driver. So moral of the conversation is Jesse killed a right rear tire there, and yeah, good thing it wasn't a 25 lap race. 25 laps would have been a, but it would have been in question. I'll be honest. Mm -hmm. well, I think we would have strategized. Hey, and Cheetos you probably are hitting the spot. Well, Jordy, I was hoping Jesse would win on your last official full night, full week, whatever you yeah. want to call it. Well, you got to win this weekend. He did win last night. We'll, we'll take it. We'll take that. Anyway, that'll do it from Southern. A little bit disappointing, but hey, we didn't tear anything up and we did get a win last night. And after all, Jesse did end up in the top five. Thank y'all for watching this video. We'll be at All Tech next weekend for rounds two and three of the Hunt the Front Super Dirt series. Don't forget you can catch that on Hunt the Front TV. Thank y'all for watching the video. Like, comment, subscribe. We'll see y'all later.